Jared here from Morgan Life HD. Now I know in my last video I said I'd be doing a new video every Saturday. Now that would have been the case this week if it hadn't been for this. Video Studio Pro X5. Now, it's a great editing program. I've had a lot of fun working with it for the past couple days. However, when I first bought it, I had one really big problem. And that was, every time I tried to upload a video from my GoPro HD Hero 2, it would say file format mismatch every time it didn't matter what I did what I changed so I went online I looked all over the internet I looked at GoPro forums I looked at Corel Studio forums I watched YouTube videos and nobody really had a real fix for it so I went on my computer I switched a few things around and I finally got it to work now I don't know if this fix is gonna work for everyone but it definitely worked for me so, I'm going to show you guys what I did to change it up, and actually now that I have fixed it, I cannot actually do anything to get the error message to come up again. I wanted to do that to show you guys what the error message looked like, but then I realized if you're here, you probably know what it looks like and you're having trouble with it. So, I'll just go straight to me showing you how I fixed it. So, the average Windows computer's default program for playing videos is going to be Windows Media Player. Now, it's a great program, it loads really quickly, I've never had any problems with it, only when I would try to upload Windows Media Player MP4s from my GoPro Hero 2 into Video Studio X5, it wouldn't work, it would say File Mismatch. Now, how I fix this, and like I said earlier, I don't know if this will work for everyone, is I downloaded a video program called DivX. And DivX is a kind of common program that a lot of websites will use to play their videos. So I went on here, I did the free download, I downloaded the newest version with all the codecs on it, and then I went through and I went here to default programs. Now I set default programs, and right now just to show you, I have Windows Media Player set as all defaults. So now I will go into DivX Player, I will hit set this program as default, and it will then set the program for defaults for every single program that it would normally be opened with. Now that includes video files. So now when I open this video file, it's going to be opened up into the newest version of DivX. It takes a little bit longer to load, and it does some funky stuff, but all in all, it's a really great program. It works really well, and it was the only way that I found to fix the problem with Video Studio. Now, when I go into Video Studio, I go File, Insert Media File, Insert Video, the same video that I downloaded from my GoPro to the computer that I had problems with originally, will now upload right into the program, no problems, no error message. That is currently the only way that I know how to fix this. I, like I said, I looked everywhere online, nothing was working. I tried this, it worked. It's the only thing that I know that for sure works. Um, I know they do have a patch for X4, if that's what you're concerned with. If you're concerned with X5 right now, they do not have a patch for it. This is the only thing that I found that worked. Hope you guys found this helpful. It definitely helped me when it came to the GoPro Hero 2 camera. Um, I don't know if, if there's any other cameras that have the problem. This might fix it as well. I'm not sure about that. Uh, leave comments in the section below if this worked for you, if it didn't work for you. Um, if there's anything else that you found that worked. Just whatever pertains to getting the GoPro Hero 2 to work on Video Studio Pro X5. And uh, have an awesome adventure, guys.